Hello, welcome to another YouTube video with me, Andy Goldstein, and the musical panda. Don't speak, don't speak. Um, yeah, I've only been doing the YouTube stuff for um, like a week now, and I'm always learning about what's needed and what's required to get you know people to watch more and subscribe. And uh, the last few videos, I thought well, I need someone to play the what's that called? Okay, good accent, ukulele. And um, I thought, I don't want to expose my daughter or son, daughter, to the world of social media, because um, once you're in that world, it's, it's vile. Um, and you're too young, aren't you? Aren't you? Yeah, okay. And you, when you grow up, you want to be like a doctor or a dentist or something important, don't you? Not a YouTuber. You want to be a YouTuber, don't you? Okay, that's horrific. Um... So anyway, I thought I'd bring her along, or him, so her. Can you play some music on you, so I can intro? So thank you for downloading this, or uploading it, or streaming it, whatever you guys do. Um, press subscribe, that's really important, and I'll bring back the, um, the musical panda for the next one. Two things coming up on this one, not one, two. First up is what happened when I played Ronnie O'Sullivan in like a practice match behind the scenes. This is October 2019, where he was on for his first ever 147 left-handed. So round about the yellow, apologies, I'll take out the camera and start filming it. And it's that way, not that way, sorry. And then stick around, because after that, there's like more poor action when I played Darren Appleton, when I was the presenter, and he just won the European World Championships or something. So um, let me know in the comments what you make of the musical panda. Can you play any, anything else, or is it just that? Just that. Okay. Here's Ronnie O'Sullivan making his first ever left-handed 147. Good work, Panda. Mm -hmm. First ever left handed maximum ever. Is that right? Yeah. First ever. First ever max. That's the first one ever you've ever done. It's the first time I've done, yeah, of course. That's amazing, isn't it? And you reffed it. Your face, look. We, we didn't get it at Eurosport, but I said we get yeah. it. Well done, son. Amazing. Yeah. Well, there you go. Ronnie O'Sullivan's very first ever left handed 147. You enjoy that, G? Thumbs up. Would you like to see some more Q action? Okay. Do you want to play in our background? So, next up is what happened when I took on Darren Appleton. Um, he was European champion, just won it. I was presenting the show for Sky. And uh, I asked if I could play him. And uh, they went, yeah. So I borrowed someone's waistcoat and someone's cue and I played him. And this is what happened. Right, ladies and gentlemen, this is a one frame challenge match between the cool European Open champion and, well, you've heard of the rocket, the whirlwind, the hurricane. This is Gale Force, Andy Goldstein. <laughs> Well, I'll tell you what, a very unusual match this is going to be. Andy Gale Force Goldstein. Well, you know when you sat at home in your armchair and you think you can beat the professionals at any sport? Well, we're going to put it to the test right now. Gale Force Goldstein. This man has been presenting professional pool tournaments. He's actually given me a little bit of stick. For this Thank last tournament, and um, Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. we're going to see how good he is. <laughs> and he's to break. And it's going to be Gale Force Goldstein to break off against Darren Appleton. <laughs> <laughs> and there you see a bit of kidology from the man. He actually used to play pool, funny enough. And Sean Beck, have you ever seen Andy Goldstein play pool? I have never seen Andy Goldstein play pool until last night. And he actually had uh, two or three practice frames with Darren, and I don't think. <laughs> 
he actually beat him. I don't think Darren beat Andy. I think... Uh... Well, I'll tell you what, Darren Appleton seems to be enjoying it. I'll play yellows. What if they're playing Yellow the money? in play. Well, the way he's going around the table, though, Goldstein, it looks more like a slight breeze than a gale force. Hey. <laughs> yes, he's going to be the only man that's going to give him a round of applause himself. Yeah. And I think if he is playing for money, he's in trouble because Darren doesn't lose money to anybody. Not very easily, anyway. <laughs> well, Goldstein now attempting his yellow into the bottom corner. A very nice shot indeed. And he's there, he's playing to the crowd as only Goldstein can. And the crowd are loving this. He's actually got a cue action like he's sawing wood. And again, it's perfect position for Goldstein. Yeah. Darren looks on in the background there. He's looking a little bit concerned. Well, I'm looking concerned because this man was giving me plenty of stick. And I said he couldn't play. Never mind clapping him, Darren. And I'll tell you what, this would be a, a fitting way to come out and play the European champion is to come out and break and clear up. Yeah, I've, I've heard that Andy could play a bit, but uh, I, th I thought it was all talk, to be honest, Tony, but um, it appears not. I'll tell you what, it should be a foul anyway, because uh, Gail Falls Goldstein's not wearing a tie out in the arena, and you're a referee, and I think you, sh you should go out there and do something about him and kick him out. No, 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 Tony. I think he's doing fine. Oh, I don't believe this. Well, well, a few years ago, Andy Goldstein reckoned he beat me in the tournament. His career best is the last 64 in Ilford Pool Club in a Sunday afternoon knockout. And he reckoned he played me, not me out of the tournament. Well, the only time I actually met Andy Goldstein was in a burger bar. I can tell who was out. I know who was having the burger, Tony, and it's not Andy from his look at his physique. What on earth is going on here? That was an absolutely fantastic shot. Somebody wants to tell Goldstein out there that he doesn't get the European title if he parts this black. I think he's got his eye on the cup. <laughs> oh, this is this is unbelievable. And his Goldstein's hand shaking this black ball into the centre pocket to dethrone Darren Appleton. And that's unbelievable. How could you knock a man like Goldstein? The gale force blows into town and blows away Darren Appleton. Well, that's it. That's it. That's not bad, is it, G? You like that? Thumbs up? Okay. <clears throat> Do you want to wave goodbye to everyone? Do you think they should subscribe? Yeah. <laughs> subscribe, yeah? Subscribe. Okay. Do you want to play us out with some music? Thanks for watching. And if you want more of my youngest, let me know. <laughs> Good work. High five. Oh, you can see. <laughs>